the Namibian desert in South Africa is famous for its low rainfall. Nevertheless, the beetle named Stenacara lives in a dry climate without a drop of rain. It is because the beetle has worked hard for a long time to overcome the environment. The beetle has a bump on its back at intervals of 1 millimeter. The tip of this bump is water friendly, but the bottom surface of the bump is not water friendly. In the morning of the desert, when it is foggy, the beetle turns its back on the direction of the wind and stands on its hand stand. Then the steam in the fog sticks to the end of the bump and the bigger drops of water roll down. At this time, the floor pushes water away, so the water droplets enter the beetle's mouth. This is how the beetle lives in a desert where there is no rain. There are so many creatures in the world. The environment in which these creatures live is all different. Some environments are good for living, but others are not. But there are no creatures that neglect their survival and growth by criticizing their own bad environment. It's the same with humans. Like the beetles in the Namibian desert, even if the environment we are in is not good, we must overcome it and continue to survive and grow.